Assalamu alaikum. We're looking at the pronunciation skill here. And this is about links between consonant sounds. What are consonant sounds? Let's start with vowels. So you know that vowels are the five letters A, E, I, O, and U. And the consonants, consonants are the other letters, the other 21 letters. So B, C, D, F, for example. So the sounds that these letters make are the consonant sounds. If you have two words that come after each other, so let's say you have a word here and you have a word here and the first word ends in a consonant sound and the second word starts with a consonant sound, then you link the two words together. You connect or join these two words together when you speak, when you, when you read these words. You don't stop and then say the consonant again. So look at this first example. You have the word authors and you have the word cell and this word ends in the consonant sound s and this word starts with the consonant sound s. It's the same consonant sound. So we link these two words when we're speaking. The same with the second example and the same with the third example. Let's listen to these three examples. Many authors sell their work online. Many authors sell their work online. These two words are connected when we pronounce it. Listen to the second example. His car had a flat tire. His car had a flat tire. His car had a flat tire. So we connect these two words. We don't stop and pause. Flat tire. We don't pronounce the t sound twice. We pronounce it once. Flat tire. Flat tire. And the third example. He's flying a big black kite. He's flying a big black kite. A big black kite. So again, the vowel sound k at the end of this word and the vowel sound k at the start of this word. So we connect them. And this is a kite that children sometimes they fly when the wind is blowing. Okay, the final part of this skill. When you have a word and the last letter in the word is an E, but the E is silent. So before the E you have a consonant. Let's say we have an N. They've used an N here. The word online, the word online, the last letter is an E, but the E is silent. And we're talking about the sound. We're not talking about the letter. When the last sound, when the last sound of the word is a consonant sound. So this word online, online, the last sound of the word is the consonant sound n, n. That's the consonant sound n. We're not worried about the E, the letter. We're worried about the sound. What is the last sound? So the last sound is n and the next word, the first sound again is n. So then we join, we join these two words together. These two words are joined together when we pronounce them. So this E, it's a silent E. The last sound is a consonant sound n and the first sound of the next word is the consonant sound n. So these two words are also linked when we pronounce them. Let's listen to the final example. I'm reading an online newspaper. I'm reading an online newspaper. An online newspaper. We connect and join and link these two words. That's the skill. If the word ends with a consonant sound and the next word starts with a consonant sound, then we link 
and join and connect with these two words when we're speaking. Thank you for watching this video and I hope you learned something.